The Reverend Jesse Jackson's message to Democratic presidential candidates, you're ignoring African Americans. In Tuesday's Chicago Sun-Times column, Jackson credits John Edwards for focusing on poverty, marking the second time in a month he's praised Edwards. But Jackson is openly supporting Barack Obama. Are you thinking about changing your support? No, I'm not. No, I'm not thinking about campaigning for anyone. I'm really thinking about putting a focus on urban policy. I'm thinking about black America in a state of emergency. The Obama campaign says it has put an emphasis on urban policy and combating poverty, saying, quote, we encourage Reverend Jackson to closely examine the senator's platform and take another look. The Obama campaign calls Jackson's voice an important one. The Clinton campaign echoes that sentiment, with a spokesman saying that Senator Clinton has outlined a significant urban agenda. I'm disappointed in the priorities that are being debated. Jackson says candidates need to focus more on the subprime mortgage crisis hitting minorities hard. He says there's an overdose on Iraq policy, but a Democratic strategist says Jackson's approach needs to be expanded. African Americans more than any other group want the war in Iraq to be over. So there are a basket of issues that concern African Americans and they don't just include poverty and issues of criminal justice and discrimination. Recent national polls show Senator Hillary Clinton leading among African American voters with Barack Obama second and John Edwards third. At a New York campaign event, Edwards was asked about why he's not doing better with black voters. I think people in New York and across America and in the African American community just need to hear my message. I mean, it is, Jesse Jackson wrote about this in the last 24 hours, it is the cause of my life to end poverty in this country. Jackson says the issues go beyond the candidates. He's challenging the media as well to keep issues affecting black voters in the spotlight. Mary Snow, CNN, New York.